Christina, Bob, that's right. As early as today, the WGA board could vote to adopt that new three-year contract before it heads to the full WGA membership for a final vote and ratification. Meanwhile, we're outside the uh, Television City Studios here, and we will continue to see picketing from SAG-AFTRA members who have yet to reach a deal with the Producers Alliance representing those major studios that have been uh, negotiating with writers. Now, while the Writers Guild has suspended picketing, WGA board members could also decide as early as today whether to officially lift the strike, and that'll clear the way for writers to resume working while the ratification vote is pending. They've been on the picket lines for nearly five months. Specifics on this new year contract are still not being released, although the writers have been pushing for more staffing, boosts in salary and residual pay, and protections against the use of artificial intelligence, which has been a big sticking point during these talks. Tough thing at the at the end was one aspect of the AI protections. Mm -hmm. So there are multiple aspects to it, but one is they, that the writers either didn't want scripts used as training material for AI systems, or or else they wanted compensation. It's not clear which position they were taking, but the uh, fact of the matter is they didn't get that. But the studios didn't get the blanket right to do it either. The parties agreed to disagree and kick the can down the road. Only on that. And with writers reaching that tentative deal, now the attention expected to turn to SAG-AFTRA with no known talks with the Producers Alliance since SAG joined the strike in July. Meanwhile, SAG-AFTRA members did vote overwhelmingly to authorize another strike against 10 of the major video game companies. The union and those companies set to resume negotiations today, and now that the strike authorization is in place, it could come any time after that if negotiations fall apart. As for the striking and picketing uh, for SAG-AFTRA, that will resume outside major studios around 9 o'clock and WGA members are being encouraged to join the SAG-AFTRA uh, picket lines in solidarity. Reporting live here in the Fairfax District, Amaria Ramirez, back to you.